October 7th, Hamas terrorists uh, massacred over 1,400 Israelis and took prisoners. Uh, Iran, or I, uh, Israel's ability to be able to defend itself is absolutely fundamental. So I've become friends with school shooters. I've seen it. Look, the NRA. So I've become friends with school shooters. I've seen it. Look, the NRA. I was an NRA guy for a long time. They used to teach gun safety. I'm of an age where my shotgun was in my car so I could pheasant hunt after football practice. That's not what. The clown show continues with these fake and scripted politics because all this stuff is is nothing more than another form of entertainment it's another way to distract people and to divide people welcome to another edition of the truth zone as always this is your host truth seeker here and this debate was very strange tim walls looks like he's on something to say the least his eyes are uh very strange to say the least if this was a person that i would cast in a uh, scary movie he would have the lead role in said movie make no mistake about it but all joking aside all of this stuff is nothing more than another way to keep people divided, keep people distracted, just like the presidential debate between Trump and Kamala. I mean, all of this stuff is just a joke. It is all a show. It is all a sham. That's all that this stuff is. These people are put in the place to act certain ways, act incompetent or what have you, just to create talking points, just to create distractions. When you have a lot of other things going on that is a lot more important than this scripted WWE garbage. Case in point, what's going on in Asheville, North Carolina? It's very suspicious what's going on, but according to the All-Seeing Eye Network and the moderators at the All-Seeing Eye Network, this is nothing more than just the climate. It has to do with the climate. That's always their excuse. Here's this clip. Let's turn now to Hurricane Helene. The storm could become one of the deadliest on record. More than 160 people are dead and hundreds more are missing. Scientists say climate change makes these hurricanes larger, stronger, and more deadly because of the historic rainfall. Senator Vance, according to CBS News polling, seven in 10 Americans and more than 60% of Republicans under the age of 45 favor the U.S. taking steps to try and reduce climate change. Senator, what responsibility would the Trump administration have to try and reduce the impact of climate change? So when you hear them talking about the climate and climate change and stuff like that, I mean, come on. This thing with Helene... And I'm going to continue to bring attention to what's going on with uh, Asheville, North Carolina, because it seems as if Asheville, North Carolina is the next Maui, Lahaina. That's what it seems like to me anyways. And I know a lot of other people are questioning what's going on there because nothing adds up. Once you begin to research all of this with how this storm moved and how quick that it moved. In my honest opinion, it was a manufactured storm. So this is more than just climate change because this is about lithium. This is about a land grab. When you begin to really do your research, you will see how suspicious all of this looks here in Asheville they're not even letting people go back to their properties look right here travel is prohibited in western North Carolina only emergency traffic is allowed past I-77 so 
this really seems like another Maui situation. So, yeah, I'm using the vice presidential debate as a way to get more focus on what's going on with Asheville, North Carolina, because my two cents when it comes to politics is it's all a selection. And even right here, yes, there is lithium in North Carolina and there are plans to reopen a lithium mine near Asheville. Huh? Perfect timing, huh? And the uh, company that wants to reopen a lithium mine is a company known as Albemarle. And what's interesting about Albemarle is the fact that BlackRock is heavily invested in said company. No surprise there. So once you begin to put the pieces together, you will see what is really going on. So they can use this clown show to continue to divide and distract people all they want when it comes to politics and whatever else. But at the end of the day, it is clear as day what is really going on and what is really happening. As always, I would ask that you would please like this video, comment down below, subscribe to the channel if you are new here, turn on the notifications so you will never miss another upload on my channel. God bless you and your families, and this is Truth Seeker signing out.